In this video we will teach you how to make a basic blouse without sleeve. For time reasons we divided this tutorial in two parts. This is the first part. The materials you will need are a cutting mat, 1 meter of fabric, 50 centimeters of fusible fabric. For this blouse, download the patterns in any size you want. Download them from our website. Paper scissors, scotch tape, fabric scissors, measuring tape, thread and chalk, pins, standard needle for your sewing machine, one meter of bias, standard presser foot, buttons, an iron, needles, and buttonhole foot. Download and print the patterns in a letter size sheet. Each sheet indicates the part so you can tape them together. It also indicates the grain line, what part it is, and size. These marks are to put the pieces together. You have to make them match so you have a good pattern. Cut each piece following the line. Use the scotch tape to put them together. You should have four patterns. Front pattern, back pattern, yoke and collar. Fold the fabric following the grain line. Place the back pattern on the folded fabric and pin the pattern. Place the yoke in the same way. Give 1 cm seam allowance in armhole, yoke union, shoulder and collar. Draw this seam allowance with chuck directly on the fabric. Give 1.5 cm allowance on the sides. Mark 3 cm on the bottom for the hem. Once you've marked them, cut the pieces. You have to cut the yoke two times, one for the lining and one for the front. Now place the front pattern and pin it. Give 1 cm seam allowance in collar, armhole and shoulder. In the center and side add 1.5 cm and again add 3 cm for the hem and cut. Cut the dart from the pattern and mark with chalk directly on the fabric. Place the collar pattern on the folding line. Give 1 cm seam allowance and cut two equal pieces. Place and fold the fusible and cut the color pattern. Put the placket on the fusible and cut. You have to do this step twice. To stick the fusible to the fabric, put the shiny side on the reverse of the collar and iron. You must iron applying pressure. Cut the remaining parts of fusible to perfect the collar. Fold the collar and cut a dart in the center. Add the fusible the same way to the bottom placket. Fold 1 cm and iron. Fold again up to the placket and iron. This will make the sewing easier. Place front to front the color pieces. Sew so 1 cm on the large top of the collar.
Make a pest punt on the fusible fabric. Fold again and close the sides of the collar. Turn inside out and the collar is ready. Take the front shirt, fold the dart and sew it. Sew both darts. Fold the dart downwards and iron. Cut the remaining sides. In the next and last part, we'll see how to sew the yoke and the plank. On the back, how to sew bias on the armholes, how to do the burner holes, and the last steps to finish the blouse. Don't forget to watch the second part of this video in our website, 123dreamit.com. Visit our website 123dreamit.com and click on the English category to get more ideas, projects, techniques, step-by-step -step tutorials and everything related to the sewing world.